In the heart of the sprawling Amazon rainforest, nestled beneath the emerald canopy of ancient trees, there lay a hidden village that harbored the most extraordinary secrets. This enchanting village was a tapestry of natural wonders, its charm unparalleled in its remote, untouched beauty. A winding river, adorned with iridescent fish, meandered gracefully through the heart of the village, casting shimmering reflections of the verdant surroundings. Inhabitants of this mystical haven were small, human-like creatures, living in harmony with the lush wilderness that embraced their existence. These diminutive beings led a life intricately woven with the rhythms of nature. They were skilled hunters, their agility unmatched as they tracked and captured small game like rabbits. In addition to their hunting prowess, they nurtured tiny crops, cultivating a variety of miniature plants that thrived in the rich Amazonian soil. One day, an intrepid explorer named Malik, hailing from distant Asia, embarked on an extraordinary journey into the heart of the Amazon. Although he had initially arrived with a group of curious tourists, Malik felt compelled to delve deeper into the wilderness alone. He yearned for a more profound connection with the enigmatic forest that beckoned to him. Malik's spirit was as adventurous as his journey was perilous. He possessed an insatiable curiosity, a longing to embrace the mysteries that awaited him amidst the towering trees and crystalline rivers of the Amazon. Armed with his backpack and a heart full of determination, Malik ventured forth, each step drawing him deeper into the enchanting embrace of the rainforest. As he ventured further into the jungle, the sheer beauty of the Amazon unfolded before Malik's eyes. Towering trees, draped with cascades of exotic foliage, stretched heavenward, their roots intricately woven into the rich earth below. The melodious calls of rare and exotic birds filled the air, creating a symphony of nature's own composition. Beneath the glistening sun, the river sparkled with life, its surface teeming with vibrant aquatic creatures, Yet, amid this breathtaking spectacle, Mallet's heart quickened as he encountered a sight that defied his comprehension. A small, humanoid creature, unlike anything he had ever seen, gazed at him with curiosity from behind the lush underbrush. Startled by Malik's presence, the creature vanished into the verdant foliage in an instant, leaving only a trace of wonder and bewilderment in its wake. Driven by an insatiable curiosity, Malik pursued the elusive creature through the dense forest. The hours passed swiftly, and the sun dipped beneath the horizon, casting long shadows that obscured his path. Lost in the labyrinthine wilderness, he eventually sought refuge in a cave, where the cool, earthy embrace of darkness offered a sheltered haven for the night. The following morning, Malik emerged from the cave, his determination undiminished. Hunger gnawed at him, but the forest provided. He foraged for wild fruits, their flavors bursting with the essence of the Amazon. Yet in this remote wilderness, there was no way for him to send word to his companions, no means to inform them of his whereabouts. Malik's hope flickered like a feeble ember, his fire futile in the face of the impenetrable forest. Desperation settled upon him as the heavens unleashed a torrential downpour, drenching him to the bone. Seeking refuge, he clambered beneath the protective canopy of a massive tree, his only sanctuary from nature's wrath. When the relentless rain finally ceased, Malik continued his solitary journey, determined to find his way back to civilization. Guided by the river's winding course, he hoped it would lead him back to familiar territory. Yet fate had other plans for him. As he approached the river's edge, a strange encounter awaited him. A group of diminutive beings, Resembling the creature he had glimpsed earlier, blocked his path, their tiny forms carrying an air of mystique. Malik attempted to cross the river, but his efforts were thwarted as he was bitten by a venomous thorn and darkness enveloped him. When Malik finally opened his eyes, he found himself encircled by a band of these small, human-like creatures, their expressions a curious mix of trepidation and curiosity. To them, he was an enigma, a towering figure in their lush, miniature world. The diminutive crowd, fearing the intrusion of this stranger, initially sought to eliminate him. But Malik, regaining consciousness in the nick of time, 
comprehended their intentions and swiftly retreated, leaving behind the bewildering spectacle of the small creatures who had nearly sealed his fate. Eventually, they took him into their village, where their initial hostility gave way to a surprising hospitality. Malik found himself embraced by their way of life, dining on the fruits of the forest, observing their ingenious hunting techniques, and even learning their intricate language. Over time, a profound connection blossomed between Malik and these small, mysterious beings, transcending language barriers and cultural differences. Yet, as the days turned into weeks and weeks into months, Malik's longing for his own world grew stronger. His heart ached for the distant lands he had left behind. With gratitude and a heavy heart, he finally made the difficult decision to depart the enchanting village that had become his home. Guided by the small creatures who had once been his captors, Malik embarked on his journey back to the world he had known. As he stepped beyond the threshold of their mystical realm, a bittersweet sorrow engulfed him. The Amazon, with its awe-inspiring beauty and its inhabitants who had welcomed him into their midst, would forever remain etched in his memory as an extraordinary chapter in his life's grand adventure.